everyone and welcome to another episode of the Baby Bunting Live series. My name is Jessie um, and tonight I've got with me Rochelle um, and, and we're going to show you um, a really great range of products from Steelcraft. So tonight we're going to talk through the all new Steelcraft Strider Signature range exclusive to Baby Bunting. So part of uh, what we're going to show you tonight or what Rochelle is going to show you tonight is uh, we've got two really exciting um, prams new to our range. The first pram is the Steelcraft Strider Signature V5, which retails at $8.99 Best Buy um, and does come with a bassinet. And you can buy a second seat for that pram separately. We do have a um, Steelcraft um, Strider Mini Signature pram as well to show you, which retails at $5.99 Best Buy and you can purchase the bassinet separately. That. Um, now, really exciting tonight is that we have got a giveaway. So we are giving away a Steelcraft Strider Signature V5, um, and all you have to do to go into the running to win this great pram is comment any of your favourite features that you see on any of our prams tonight that Rochelle demonstrates, and pop them in the comments, um, and, and you can go into the running to win your very own V5, which is really exciting. Um, also, um, we do um, have, um, if you do have any questions tonight, of course, on any of the products that we show, um, just pop them in the comments and we'll do our best to get back to you at the end of this session. Uh, and we'll also be linking um, those products as well. So you can check them out on the website if you feel like that as well. So I won't talk anymore. Um, I will hand over to Rochelle to demonstrate these great products. Thanks, Thanks Rochelle. Thanks, Jessie. All right, good luck to those who are entering the competition. I hope you win. Um, I'm going to take you through, first of all, our Strider Signature V5. But first I want to tell you a little bit about the history of Steelcraft. Steelcraft was founded in Melbourne in 1947. And it's actually um, quite amazing. It was a father-to-be, Colin N. Johnston, who actually created a pram for his wife and unborn child in his backyard shed. So uh, seven decades later, we're still carrying on his legacy and we're producing products that are making parents' lives easier, but also providing comfort for your little ones and enabling all of us to be able to move freely and continue our lives even with little ones in tow. So Strider B5 Signature. The amazing thing is that it comes as the stroller with click and go adapters. That means that it is suitable for a travel system. Our click and go Unity capsule, the Brightex, um, straight out of the box. And also comes with a lay flat solution for newborn, which is our bassinet. So I'm going to take you through the bassinet first. The bassinet has a huge canopy, has the visor, it has leatherette details. UPF 50 plus protection and a water resistant coating, which means that it's suitable for light showers. It has, I'm just gonna turn it around so that you can see, a viewing window, which has soft magnetic closures, just so you don't wake the little one. And that reveals a sort of a dark fine mesh and that keeps it still dark inside, but allowing airflow. It also allows you to peek in on your little one if they are sleeping. We also, because we're an Australian business, we understand the Australian, well, the weather and how um, random it can be. Um, what we've designed is two zips either side here that reveal an additional mesh that allows ventilation near your child's head. To roll this up, to store it away, you just roll that up. It's got the little tab with the Velcro and you just stick it under there. And that allows lots of ventilation for your little one because they can get quite hot and sweaty in an enclosed environment. It comes with a boot cover. Now the boot cover is just press stud either side. The boot cover has a huge zipper pocket that you can put all those things that you might need. Dummy, socks, beanie, who knows what you might need. And also maybe a muslin cloth in there. It is lined with a beautiful brushed fabric which is soft to touch. I'll just pop this down and I'm just gonna show you inside the bassinet. The bassinet has the same brushed fabric liner that is easy to remove for washing. It has a belly strap to keep your baby in position when you're moving around. 
Then we do this belly strap and we have a firm mattress and it is reversible. One side which is warm to touch for those cooler days. And then on the other side is what we have is our it helps to wick away sweat from the skin and keeping your baby cool in summer and warm in winter. Okay, pop that back in. The bassinet is very easy to remove and it's great for those daytime naps. So we're going to put the canopy back up. Just make sure that that's locked position. Roll that down. And then you've got two buttons either side that you just pop your fingers in. There's a recess and then you lift up and you can remove the bassinet. And it's that easy. You can pop this down somewhere for those daytime naps inside the house or keep it on the stroller. As they get older, so this is suitable from newborn up until six months, which is about nine kilos. Um, and then what you would do is transition to the seat. So I've got that already set up over here. We have the top seat. Same as the bassinet, it has UPF 50 plus protection and the water resistant coating. The visor for extra protection. It has a huge extension. So look at that. If we recline this seat, you can see how much protection your little one has while still allowing airflow through. For those really hot summer days, the same window, and I'm just going to turn it around so you can see, the same soft magnetic closure on the bassinet and you just roll that up and that allows you to peekaboo through to your little one or allows airflow. Pop that down. Okay, we're going to talk about inside the seat. So we'll just adjust this up into its upright position. So we're really thinking about how you use the product every day. So think about the change in seasons and this can happen even throughout the day. You start off with a t-shirt and then you can end up with a big woolly jumper or a jacket. And so you wanna be able to easily adjust the harness. So this adjustment here is as they grow, but also for depending what they're wearing. We'll just open up this arm bar so you can see inside. For adjustment, it's really easy. You just move these little toggles and that's around the waist as well. And we have a very streamlined crutch protector in here that just adds extra comfort. When we release this, you can see that the seat is curved and this really, and the backrest is curved as well. And that contours to your little one's body shape. You have an adjustable leg rest for comfort. And you can also pop this leg rest inside out for when their legs aren't quite long enough to reach the footrest and you've got a smooth transition from the seat to this area. Pop it back down as they grow and they can rest their feet on here. The arm bar, which is a textured leatherette, easy to, to keep clean and very durable. It's easy to remove and pivot. So you have buttons on both sides so you can pivot on either side or remove it entirely. Easy to pop back in and just push it in like so. So that's the seat. The seat is reversible. So when they're young, what you would like to do is we call this view world facing. You're gonna turn it around. And this is what we call parent facing. And if they're quite young, because this seat is suitable for newborn, what you want to do is have it in its lowest recline so that it just keeps their neck in a position and they're not holding or supporting the, the weight of their head. So you can see lots and lots of protection, really engaging with your little one. The pivot handlebar, which is great for tall people, short people, is also good when you're positioning in the lowest position because it really helps you to access your little one, getting them in and out, adjusting their, their um, whatever you might need to do. We'll pop that back in. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we'll turn this seat around. Like so. And lift up. 
comes with the strider is the parent organizer. Now this parent organizer, we're always thinking about how you're gonna use it. You're gonna put all your valuables in here, but your child needs to play at the play equipment. So what we've done is we've designed it so you can easily remove it from the handlebar by just undoing these press studs. Pop them back together. You've got quiet magnetic closures for security, a big pocket at the front, just loose, a secure pocket inside, and then a little loop for a little bottle. Close that up, off you go to the playground. You've got an adjustable strap that you can sling over your shoulder, and now you have all your valuables with you. So that's the parent organizer. Now we talk about the basket, because we know that all parents need huge capacity. You're gonna need all your nappies, um, all your nappy bag, and then what do you do if you're doing grocery shopping? So this is a 12 kilogram basket. It has huge capacity and volume, as you can see here. A extension at the back, which has pockets for a drink bottle or anything else. And we also have a divider that can either pop down or lift up. And then at the front, we also have easy access Move to the leg rester and you have an extension here. So depending on how much volume you have in the basket. It also, this centre section, doubles as a foot rest when you're in tandem mode, which I'll take you through shortly. Now, how to fold the strider. Now, the strider can fold with the seat on. So I'm going to first show you that. You want to make sure your brake is on. Now, yes, my brake is already on. And then you've got two triggers either side of the frame. You're going to lift those triggers and then you fold the stroller. And on the other side that you can't see, so I'm just going to turn around, there is a frame lock. And you want to make sure that the frame lock is engaged. And then all you do is just adjust that leg rest so it's lower. And that's the freestanding fold with the seat on. If you're going from the park to the car, our recommendation is to remove the seat first. So let's just undo this. And I'm gonna show you how to fold and lift the most ergonomic way to get it in your car. So take the seat off first, two buttons either side of the seat, lift, pop that in your car. Folding it the same way, you've got two triggers, and then you're going to Fold downwards and then tilt it towards you because there's a protector on the handlebar to prevent the handlebar from scratching. And then lift it forwards to yourself until this bar sits on the front of your legs. What we're going to do is bend at the knees, hold down on the frame, and then when you lift up, you can put it directly into the boot. Pop it down. And that's how easy it is. Open it up. I also want to talk through about the suspension. We'll pop the seat back on because it looks so much nicer with the seat. Suspension. We have dual rear suspension. Now that's what this is here. And this, when you push down, is just like a mountain bike. So think about all that shock absorbing of different terrains. So this is an all-terrain stroller. It also has suspension in the front wheels that are built in. So if I just show you, if I push down on that, you can see that there is suspension in the front also. The wheels are made from a rubber outer and foam inner. So the rubber outer is durable and gives you traction, where the foam on the inside gives you more suspension and comfort. And that is our Strider B5. What I'm now going to take you through is how it converts into tandem mode. So, Tandem mode, you need to purchase the second seat pack. And what comes with the second seat pack is the second seat, a pair of mud guards, and also what we call a set of seat extenders. So the seat extenders are to allow more space between the back seat and the front seat. So we just take top seat off. seat extenders in. It's really easier to click on both sides and pop that seat back in. Okay, we've got 
You've got the top seat. Now, to prepare the stroller, we will need to remove this back extension. Now, this has a Velcro, a press stud on both sides, a strap with a press stud down here near the wheels, and you let that drop down. And then what we're going to do is turn it around so that you can see is a zip and you're just going to undo the zip and that's it. Remove the extension. The mud guards, we have, not sure whether you can see, an R and an L. R means on the right hand side when you're facing the back and you just slide that down until it clicks on both sides. All right, done. Now the second seat. You have a pivot rear leg here. Hold on to that on both sides and then a little silver pin on both sides and you're going to make sure that the silver pin enters the channel in the rear. Drop it down and then you've got the adjuster at the back that you can position. And that's your tandem. So huge canopy, has the same features as the top seat has the visor, UPF 50 plus, water resistant, quiet magnetic closures and the viewing and ventilation panel. Inside, easy adjust harness. Um, and one thing that I forgot to mention before is we also know that parents can often lose harness pads or they position down on the belly of the child. So we've added an extra secure press stud that just keeps them in position. Extra comfort for little ones. So different configurations. We can also do, if we adjust this seat rest, recline, we can have parent facing in the top. So what my recommendation is, because there's so many configurations, check out the Steelcraft website or the Baby Bunting website and it has all of the configurations that you can do. If you just the leg rest to provide a little bit more room up there and that is another configuration. So we can also offer a travel system. I'm going to show you the travel system in the top seat. So we'll remove this. Click and go adapters that come with the stroller because you can do this in single mode. So we'll remove the seat extenders and here's the click and go adapters those in. Now click and go directly clicks to our bright axe unity and pop that in and that's a travel system option. You can have if you remove the soft goods from the second seat you can have two infant carriers one at the top and one at the bottom and you can have a combination one on the bottom top seat and if you check out the configurations you'll see. So that's the strider. We are so proud to be partnered with Baby Bunting on these exclusive products and we're so confident in our quality that we're offering a lifetime warranty for the Strider B5. It's really exciting that we can offer such an amazing package for such an affordable price. Now, the other thing is we also have our Strider Mini. Now the Strider Mini, thinking that it's Strider but it's Mini, is just that. It is the same features as the Strider, but it is only for one child. It is slightly smaller, so let me just line this up to see if you can see. It has, maybe if we turn it around this way, it has smaller wheels, but the wheels are still foam filled rubber wheels. It has the same dual suspension. The differences are that it has 10 kilo basket capacity, whereas the Strider has 12. The weight of the Mini is 10 kilograms over 14 kilograms. So you can see that there's a difference between the weight and the size. For the fold, it has a very similar fold, so it can fold with the seat on. It has the two triggers either side. Just that leg rest down. So you can see it's more compact than the Strider. The only thing is that it doesn't come with the bassinet. 
So if you're looking for a lay flat solution, because this is newborn up until 20 kilos, you can purchase the bassinet separately, but we are also developed five different accessories. We have a newborn and toddler comfort pack, and it comes with a wedge, an insert, and also a head pillow. And that really allows for that lay flat solution if you're looking at the Strata Mini, or you could buy up to a bassinet, or you can also go directly to a Unity because it has click and go connection, so you could do a treble system. So very minor differences, single child, um, weight is 10 kilos, the wheels are a bit smaller, and of course it's a sport small fold. Um, it does come with, the only thing that it does come with is the parent organiser. So think that Strider is quite, Strider Mini is quite simple. It comes as the stroller with the parent organiser and if you want any other additional accessories, they're sold separately. The other accessories that we've developed is a rain cover that's suitable for single and tandem mode. We have a cup holder that's specially designed for a flexible fit so it can fit different bottle sizes. And we are also excited to to be able to be maxi cozy, Miko and Nuna Click Plus compatible with some adapters for that configuration. So please check out our um, information about more about our configurations and compatibility. All right, Jesse, I think I'm done. <laughs> wow, Rochelle, that was amazing. Um, so knowledgeable and thank you so much for, I guess, showing our audience all those products tonight. Those my two pleasure, products. my pleasure. It is pretty exciting to show everyone. Uh, I think my favourite feature on the V5 was definitely that basket. Yeah. It's incredible. So much room for storage, which is so important for our audience and, and parents. It is, it is. I mean, really, we really at Steelcraft, where focus is to provide parents all of the features that you need on a daily basis. Absolutely. Um, now, I think, uh, do we have any questions, Nat, from our audience? We do. Mallory has asked what colour the Mini comes in. Oh, okay. So, the Mini comes in the black gum, which is what we've just shown here, and it also comes in the same colour as this one here, which is our silver wattle, and that comes as a silver frame. And that's all the questions. Um, I think if there are any more questions, of course, you know, we will, um, please please comment on the feed and we will get back to you. Uh, we do have, um, you know, our team from Steelcraft, they're on standby to answer your questions and obviously the Baby Bunting team will um, help answer some as well. Thank you so much, Rochelle, for joining us tonight. It's Very been nice. an absolute pleasure to have you on the episode tonight. Um, and I think, I, I really do hope that our audience has found um, this information helpful um, for when you go to purchase your next pram. So thank you. Um, and uh, next time I'll see you on the live series, but before I head off, um, if you guys do want to see a particular brand featured or um, you want to know more about any products, um, please shoot us a, a DM in Messenger. We'd be more than happy to receive some feedback uh, from you guys and what you want to see out of the live series. Um, but thank you all for watching tonight and joining us. Um, and I hope you all have a really nice evening. Bye. Thank you.